What's going on guys? Tactical here, welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. In the last episode, we fought, fought our way through the temple, uh, went through a bunch of a uh, bunch of crazy cultists, dragonlings, drakes. Uh, we snuck past a high dragon, and we made it here to the gauntlet on the final stretch to, to get the urn of sacred ashes. So now, I don't know what we gotta do. Echoes from a shadow realm. Whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? Um... <laughs> indigestion. The moon? That is not of what I speak. Damn it! Uh, these these riddles, I, I don't remember them, but... That somebody I I'm not great at riddles, you guys. There goes that one. I've never been good at riddles. Alright, let's talk to Alice. The smallest lark could carry it, while a strong man might not. Of what do I speak? A tune. That one that one's easy. Yes. I was Andraste's dearest friend in childhood, and always we would sing. She celebrated the beauty of life, and all who heard her would be filled with joy. They say the maker himself was moved by Andraste's song, and then she sang no more of simple things. Okay. Now let's talk to Lady Vasilia. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood must be paid in full. Of what do I speak? Vengeance. Yes, my husband Hesarian would have chosen a quick death for Andraste. I made him swear that she would die publicly with her war leaders. That all would know the Imperium's strength. Okay. I am justice. I am vengeance. Blood can only be repaid in blood. Okay. That's weird. So, Thane Sharton. <laughs> Shard. <laughs> oh boy. Oh lord, see the term shark means so means something completely different than Oh, and I'm pretty sure the people when when Bioware made this they didn't think of that. I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Huh? Of what do I speak? Um... Repeat that, please! I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Oh my god, that is difficult. Um... Guess? That is not Damn. of what I speak. Shall be done. Yeah, and that, that, that riddle I didn't understand. So, I want you guys to do me a favor when you're watching this. If you know the answers to any of these riddles that I'm getting wrong, don't put them in the comments. Just let me know if you know it. General Maffarath. A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows. Till love lies slain. Ooh. Of what do I speak? Um. That would be jealousy, correct? Yes. Okay. Jealousy drove me to betrayal. I was the greatest general of the Alamari. But beside her, I was nothing. Hundreds fell before her on bended knee. They loved her. As did the Maker. I loved her too. But what man can compare with a god? Damn. That puts a lot into perspective. Disciple Havard. The bones of the world stretched towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. Of what do I speak? Huh. Mountains. That's got to be it. Yes. Boom. Some I of these carried Andraste's okay, so ashes most of these out have been of Divinta pretty easy. into the mountains to the east. 
where she could gaze ever into her maker's sky. No more fitting a tomb than this could we find. All right, only two more left. Disciple Cather. No man has seen it, but all men know it. Lighter than air, sharper than any sword. Comes from nothing, but will fell the strongest armies. Of what do I speak? Ooh. Hunger. Yes. Yes. Hunger was the weapon used against the wicked men of the Teventer Imperium. The Maker kindled the sun's flame, scorching the land. Their crops failed, and their armies could not march. Then he opened the heavens and bade the waters flow, and washed away their filth. I am Kefer, disciple of Andraste and commander of her armies. I saw these things done and knew the Makers smiled on us. Okay. Kefer. Archon Hesarian. She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Of what do I speak? Repeat that. I, for some reason, my brain just did, my my brain just didn't catch it. She wields the, the broken, broken sword, sword and separates, separates true, true kings, kings from, from tyrants. tyrants. Of what do I speak? Wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Crap. Um. I don't know if it's weakness, time, or... I don't know if it's weakness or mercy. I'm gonna go with mercy. Yes. I could not bear the sight of Andraste's suffering, and mercy bade me end her life. I am the penitent sinner, who shows compassion, as he hopes compassion will be shown to him. Hmm. Oh. All right. Lesky. Okay. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You're not Lesky. Oh, I'm not. <laughs> Just a memory pulled out of your head, huh? Don't mean nothing. You never really cared about us. Knew you were meant for greater things. Up there, the surface. You know I had to leave. That's the way it goes, isn't it? You can't afford to think about the past. You have to look forward. I'm proud of you for moving on. Here, I found this lying around and I have no use for it. I know you'll do something good with it. Goodbye, my friend. Remember me. Goodbye, Lesky. What did I get? What did, what did he give me? See, I wish it would tell you what you were given. That's the only thing I don't want. Reflection. This must be it. Or the Ring of Faith. It's for a mage only, so... Plus one constitution, plus 15 to healing effects received. Alright, um... Well, I'm gonna give her the Ring of Faith. Wait, what does it do? Oh, plus 10 fire damage. Cool. Uh... See, they all have a necklace except for Zevron. So I'm going to give him reflection. Thank you, Lesky. Goodbye, my friend. I'm sorry it had to end the way it did. See, I wish they would have put some uh, something in the uh, speak uh, like a uh, a uh, dialogue pathway to get Lesky to turn a uh, turn and fight with you instead of against you and possibly even join your party. That would have been cool. Looks like we're in for some fun. What the hell? We're facing off against ourselves. That's a damn metaphor, ain't it? And that, that's just insane. We're facing off against ourselves. Or, so I guess it could be our inner demons. Our inner demons, maybe. Everybody okay? What the hell? Andraste loved her disciples. As she loved the Maker, as we have faith in the Maker, so must we have faith. It is certain this means I should help you with this test. I have faith in my friend well enough. 
faith that they will one day stab me in my back. So is that. Uh huh. I see. I want one. There's the trick. Each piece must be sunk in order for one of us to cross. Command me. All right, so let's do this one. Okay, where's the solid one? Maybe over here? Nope. Come on. This is tricky. Very tricky. So I'm just trying to figure it out here. Nope. 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 Okay. Oh, God damn it. Got it. Speak on. All right, so next piece. Where is it? Can I move off mine? I can. Perfect. And now... Ogren. Perfect. And Morgan finally takes the last one. Correct? Wait, what? Wait, what? Alright, I'm gonna pause the recording. I'll come back once I've got it fixed, because this is gonna take a while. Alright, guys, I got it. So now we, let's move forward. Yeah, that, it took me a while to get that right. What? Powerful oh. magic indeed. Very powerful. Let's interact with the altar. This altar is a little more, is little more than a dusty stone slab. You can make out an inscription card into its face. Cast off the trappings of worldly life and cloak yourself in the goodness of spirit, king and slave, lord and beggar, be born anew in the Maker's sight. Remove equipment. Ah, we're in our underwear. Now what? Wait, no, okay. We Wait. have much to do. Wait, what now? Can we? Armed and armored. You have tried to approach Andraste. Why have you committed this act of defiance? Oops. Oops. Sorry. In the Maker's eyes, a beggar may as well be a king, or a king a beggar. He cares not for the privilege granted by birth. One can only find spiritual truth by casting aside earthly possessions and seeing them for the deceptions they are. Can I go back and take it off? No. You have passed through the flame. There is no going back. 
You have shown that you are not worthy of the ashes. Oh, crap. May the Maker take you into his arms. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I... Not options, damn it. Can I load back and do this again? Oh... Uh, Give me a second. I'm going to save here and then go back to that auto save and see what happens. Be right back, guys. All right, everybody, I'm back. Uh, I auto save took me back a little bit farther, so but I'm back. And so let's try this again because I don't want to fight the Guardian. So let's remove our equipment and walk through. You have been through the trials of the gauntlet. You have walked the path of Andraste, and like her, you have been cleansed. You have proven yourself worthy, Pilgrim. Approach the sacred ashes. Cool. Let's let's level Morgan up real quick. One second, guys. Ah, I got a scratch. There we go. All right, so let's level her up. Uh, three. Uh, we're going to give one to Constitution, one to Cunning. We're actually going to up our magic to 25. And then we are going to increase her combat training and give her the... Hmm. Oh, let's see. What should we give her? What is this? Death magic. While active, the caster draws in nearby entropic energy. Draining residual life force from any dead enemy nearby to heal the caster. I like that. I'm putting it on her. There we go. Let's. We got unfortunate adventure. Oh wait, what? What's going on? Damn it! I don't. The urn of sacred ashes. I stand in awe. Really? That's it? <laughs> Thought it would be bigger. Nice vase. I should get one for my house. These are the er earthly remains of Andraste, prophet and bride of the Maker. I'm going to take a single pinch of the ashes. You take a pinch of the ashes and place it in a leather pouch. Man. I actually just got chills, believe it or not. And on that adventure, we got the Belt of the Magister Lords, the Golden Demon Pendant, and the Silver Chalice. Who does that Golden Demon Pendant go to? Let's find out. Let's see who gets the Golden Demon Pendant. It would go to... Morrigan. Perfect. Well, since we've got her in the party, first I want to see what this does. Plus three spell power. Okay. She already has a belt. Gives her willpower and mental resistance, but I'm going to give her the golden demon pendant. A fine gift. You Perfect. Uh, what's in the chest? Two greater health poultices. Let's look around and see what else we got. Because we got two doors here. Pass. A health ball is an intricate. That goes to the mountaintop. They both go to the mountaintop. So, let's go. I can't. I'm not. I'm not kidding, guys. That freaking. That gave me. That gave me some chills. And now Ogren's leveled up. So let's do it. I'm gonna increase his strength to 36. And increase his improve. Increase him to improve combat tactics. And give him the two-handed sweep skill or talent, rather. Uh, and since I'm since his strength's higher, uh huh. See, we can give him better uh, stuff now. So let's see. Juggernaut plate armor way better than the armor of diligence. It gives him all those resistances. 
effort. 50% healing effects. Does nothing. So I'm going to give him the Juggernaut Plate Armor. I'm going to give him the full set. Except the helmet. I don't have the helmet. Does Rock Knocker go with that? No, it doesn't. It's a little bit better than the helmet he's got. Uh, do I have another helmet to compare with that? I don't. So, we're going to give him Rock Knocker. So, we're, we're only missing one piece of the Juggernaut thing. But now, see, we, we can also give him a better possible oh lord look at that 16 damage so we're gonna give that to him all right let's move hopefully we don't have to fight the fucking dragon because I don't want to do that I just want to get I just want to get back to where we need to go I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna pause the recording I'll unpause when we get out of here hopefully we don't have to fight the dragon all right, we're back in the main room of the temple, everybody. We have a pinch of there and of sacred of the ashes. I. So now, is that guy still waiting on us? Hell yes, he is. Awesome. Very good. Welcome back. You were gone for quite some time. Well, did you find it? The urn, yes. What? What was it like coming to the urn? I mean. Nothing has touched me quite so deeply. You are a very fortunate person. And so am I. Perhaps my research will not seem so much like blasphemy to the Chantry now. We must organize an expedition. There is so much history here, it must be studied. And, and pilgrims should be allowed to come to the Urn. That is not wise. Many will try to exploit this discovery. But the Urn belongs to all the faithful. How can you deny this to them? No, we must share it. And perhaps charge an entrance fee, no? I wish people wanted to share me more often. <laughs> Especially the ladies. I want more ladies to share me. <laughs> Augren, you let I will spread this good news or die trying. If something bad comes of this, it is your fault. I must return home. I have much to do. If you ever find yourself in Denerim, please visit me. I am not a rich man, but I have a small collection of interesting artifacts, and I do owe you a reward for coming to my rescue. I hope to see you soon, my friend. Oh, we'll see him soon, because we're going right to Denerim to get our damn reward. But yeah, um, I really don't agree. Something like the Urn of Sacred Ashes should not be shared with the world, because somebody's going to exploit it. Somebody's going to screw it up. So let me get to Denerim. Where the fuck is Denerim? Here we go. Let me. We'll head back to Denerim and go meet up with him again. So we can collect our damn our reward that we earned for saving his sorry ass. Oh, what now? Always Will something. You stop eating. Let me listen to him. Oh, I'm hungry. Stuff your face at camp. For now, watch the bloody road. Leave and skillfully evade their clueless trap. Be quiet, everybody. Can't go that way. I'm trying to see which way to go. This way. Trap. Ha ha. We have skillfully evaded your trap. Maybe. They've got Look their... there, a cunning trap. It's a trap. We might be able to pull this off. Look there, a cunning trap. Ha ha. I've skillfully evaded your trap, sir, dumbass. Or whatever the hell your name is.
Actually, I like I like I like the name Sir Dumbass. Like, how could you not trap the area I just walked through? Like, seriously, you have nobody watching. So, what do we have to do in Denerim now? Because I, it's yes, I know. Uh, let's see. Find someone to cipher the scrolls. Trial of the crows. Crawls before swine. Great scale armor. As there is but one world, one life. There's a sister Justine. Strange that matters can be so tumultuous and yet the day still be so bright. Oh, my pardon. Just thinking aloud. Are you here for the chanter's board? Who are you? I am Sister Justine, curator of the reliquary of this chantry. <laughs> And pride again. It is hard to live up to the example of Andraste. What's a curator do? The archivist tends the books, and I tend the sacred okay. relics. I also search for more to add to our collection, which is more difficult than it sounds. I found these scrolls in a Tevinter ruin. Really? Oh, pardon my incredulity. I would like to examine them in any event. Be careful with them, they seem ancient. Let me see. The scrolls are old, no question, and the script. It's written in cipher. Early believers used them to keep their writings safe from the Devinter Magus. These could be authentic. Please, let me examine it. Here you go. I need parchment, quill, and ink. What was the trick to the cipher again? Ah. Okay. I examined your scrolls. I know a few of the early Chantry ciphers, but I'm not fully familiar with this one. The bits I have made out. This may be an account of Maferath's final days, and perhaps more. Maferath? As in Andraste's husband? I know. It's remarkable. The same Maferath who betrayed our prophet and saw her burn alive in Minrathrus. If we could get a real translation, well, it could be the find of our lifetime. How long will it take to decipher? It could take months. The ciphers were designed to be difficult for the Magisters to decrypt. Who knows what secrets we can uncover, what truths we can find. Here is all of the allowance I have for acquisitions. Take it and go. A thousand, thousand blessings. Sweet. We got, we got paid. Let's see now. I'm gonna. Where the hell is Brother Genitivi's house again? I can't remember where the hell, which freaking home he lives in. Hey, a wooden crate that's got something in it. What's in it? Health poultice. All right, Genitivi, where the hell? Did you hear? On Droste's. Where the hell is his freaking home? Odd Noble. Ah, oh, Jenner TV's home. If it isn't the champion who succeeded in the quest for the Sacred Urn, I had not expected to see you so soon. I've written to the Chantry, telling them of your adventures. They are interested in having me lead an expedition. What do you think of that? I'm quite excited. That's great news, Brother Jenner TV. You made this all possible. I could never thank you quite enough, but I'm certainly going to try. Here, take this reward. I want you to have it. It will certainly do more good in your hands than lying around in this dusty house, eh? And if I can ask, have you gone to see the Arl? I have heard no news. I have not gone to see him yet. Then hurry. I pray it's not already too late. And now, if you will... Ex all right. There we go. Let's see what we what he gave us. I want to know because Okay, nothing there. No. Belt of the Magister Lords plus 3 spell power. I guess that's what he gave us. That's got to be what it is. So, let's go back out to the market district. I will do some selling and buying and I will be right back, guys. 
All right, everybody, we are just arriving at the castle. So let's go. Let's head inside and uh, get the get the uh, ashes to the to uh, the arm. Now, you know, I know my uh, video yesterday. I talked about the possible possibility of doing a charity live stream. It, I'm, it's probably actually going to be after the new year because uh, I actually sent an email to the Joyful Heart Foundation directly to possibly do a kind of a partner up on it to try it. so that way so I'm gonna wait basically what they would end up doing in that situation was would be making sure it would basically be to maximize the viewers and possible donations that way you know we don't have to work that way nobody has to worry about not that way nobody has to worry about no donations being made because of these small audience I have for the channel so when if I do uh, when I do hear from them, I will update everybody, though. So let's talk to Bantiga. Uh, might you have news? I found the urn. You have? Wonderful. Let us go at once to Eamon's side and see if the urn's healing powers live up to their reputation. Yes. Let's hope they do. Please work. Holy shit. Where am I? Be calm, brother. You have been deathly ill for a very long time. Do you remember nothing? Tegan? What are you doing here? Where is Isolde? I am here, my husband. I'm Connor. Where is my boy? Where is our son? He lives. Though many others are dead. There is much to tell you, husband. Dead? Then... It was not a dream. Much has happened since you fell ill, brother. Some of it will not be... Easy for you to hear. Then tell me. I wish to hear all of it. Wow. Could you guys imagine... What he would be feeling? This is most troubling. There is much to be done, that is true. But I should first be thankful to those who have done so much. Grey Warden, you have not only saved my life, but kept my family safe as well. I am in your debt. Will you permit me to offer you a reward for your service? If you'd like, I will not object. Then allow me to declare you, and those traveling with you, champions of Redcliffe. You will always be a welcome guest within these halls. And for you, Warden, a shield of the same make as those that have been given to our finest knights. Thank you, Your Grace. We should speak of Loghain, brother. There is no telling what he will do once he learns of your recovery. Loghain instigates a civil war even though the Darkspawn are on our very doorstep. Long I have known him, he is a sensible man, one who never desired power. I was there when he announced he was taking control of the throne, Eamon. He is mad with ambition, I tell you. Mad indeed. Mad enough to kill Caelan to attempt to kill myself and destroy my lands. Whatever happened to him, Loghain must be stopped. What's more, we can scarce afford to fight this war to its bitter end. But you can unite the nobility against Loghain, can't you? I could unite those opposing Loghain, yes. But not all oppose him. He has some very powerful allies. We have no time to wage a campaign against him. Someone must surrender if Ferelden is to have any chance of fighting the Darkspawn. But once everyone learns what he's done... I will spread word of Loghain's treachery, both here and against the King. But it will be but a claim made without proof. Those claims will give Loghain's allies pause, but we must combine it with a challenge Loghain cannot ignore. We need someone with a stronger claim to the throne than Loghain's daughter, the Queen. Are you referring to Alistair, brother? 
Are you certain? I would not propose such a thing if we had an alternative. But the unthinkable has occurred. You intend to put Alistair forward as king? Tegan and I have a claim through marriage, but we would seem opportunists no better than Loghain. Alistair's claim is by blood. And what about me? Does anyone care what I want? You have a responsibility, Alistair. Without you, Loghain wins. I would have to support him for the sake of Ferelden. Is that what you want? I... B but I... No, my lord. I see only one way to proceed. I will call for a landsmeet, a gathering of all of Ferelden's nobility in the city of Denerim. There, Ferelden can decide who shall rule, one way or another. Then the business of fighting our true foe can begin. What say you to that, my friend? I do not wish to proceed without your blessing. Hmm. I say we, uh, I say we proceed with your plan. Very well. I will send out the word. But before we proceed, I believe there is the matter of the mage, my son's tutor. He still lives, I understand. He does. He is in the dungeon, brother. Have him brought here, Tegan. I wish to see him. Jowan, what you have done is not in question. You tried to assassinate me and set into motion a series of events that nearly destroyed everything I cherish. What have you to say in your own defense? Nothing, my lord, other than to say I am sorry. I expect no mercy for what I have done. I see. Grey Warden, have you anything to say on Jowan's behalf? Let's see. He seems earnest in his desire to repent. Oh? That is... unexpected. And what would you have me do? As the injured party, my ability to see the merciful path is... strange. Let's see. Give him to the circle of magi. True enough, and wisely said. Jowan, I hereby turn you over to the tower of the circle of magi. May the maker have mercy on your soul. Thank you, my lord. Now, back to the matter of the landsmeet. We should head to Denerim as soon as possible. I can delay that, however if you have other plans. I would prefer not giving Loghain time to consider, but it is up to you. I do not wish to go to Denerim unless you are with me. Um, I'm thinking here. Because we do have some side quests that I actually would like to do before we head to what could, what is the final act. So give me some time yet. As you wish. It will take time for the news to spread. And I can use the interim to get my forces organized. Please tell me when you wish to leave. Until then, you have the run of Redcliffe. Thank you. Thank you, sir. And we've leveled up now. So let's put into... We only have one attribute point, so let's just put it into strength. Let's increase our combat tactics. So we've got... The, we've basically got some side quests. Uh, for the Blight, Arl of Redcliffe, Gather the Army, Rosellian Forest, we still have Elora's Hala, Mage's Treasure, recovered three of the items hidden in the forest, one item remains to find. So there's still another item remaining. Uh, we still have some stuff in Denerim to do. Uh, let's see. Um. Where's a mar? Exotic method doesn't... An herbalist in the royal palace give you... Okay. Okay, and the Kokari Wilds, Last Will and Testament. We re actually, we really don't have much to do because we can do them in Denerim. So we're going to finish this uh, episode up by talking to Arl Eamon. When you're ready, we shall leave for Denerim. Let's go. Excellent. I shall make the arrangements. Let us be off to Denerim, and may the Maker watch over us.
So we'll do it this, we'll go take care of that, and then we'll finish up the episode. Hopefully we don't get forced into a long... Denarim is the heart and soul of Ferelden. It was the city of King Kalanad, the birthplace of Andraste. As stubborn as a Mabari, and as good to have on your side. If we defeat Loghain here, the rest of the nation will follow us. By calling the Landsmeet, I've struck the first blow. The advantage for the moment is ours. He will have little choice but to show himself, to oppose us directly. He will strike back at us. The only question that remains is how soon. Loghain, this is an honor that the Regent would find time to greet me personally. How could I not welcome a man so important as to call every lord in Ferelden away from his estates while a blight claws at our land? The blight is why I'm here. With Caelan dead, Ferelden must have a king to lead it against the Darkspawn. Ferelden has a strong leader. It's queen. And I lead her armies. Considering Ostagar, perhaps we need a better general. And who is this, Eamon? Some new stray you picked up on the road? And here I thought it was only royal bastards you play the nursemaid to, not Orzammar's rejects. I am a witness to your crimes at Ostagar. You should curb your tongue. This is my city, and no safe place to speak treason. For anyone. There is talk that your illness left you feeble, Eamon. Some worry that you may no longer be fit to advise Ferelden. And here I thought it was only royal bastards you play the nurse uh -oh. to, not Orzammar's rejects. Uh-oh. How long you've been gone there from There was a glitch in audio there, guys. Don't you recognize On the game's Rendon part. Howe, Arl of Amaranthine, and Terran of High Ever? And current Arl of Denerim. Since Urien's unfortunate fate at Ostagar, the Regent has been generous to those... God, I love hearing Tim Royal. Curry's voice doing stuff like this. Uh, let's see. Bootlicking appears to be profitable these days. Don't interrupt, Churl. Your betters are talking. Enough, Kiss my Tarkian. ass! This is not the time or place. I had hoped to talk you down from this rash course, Eamon. Our people are frightened. Our king is dead. Our land is under siege. We must be united now if we are to endure this crisis. Your own sister, Queen Rowan, fought tirelessly to see Ferelden restored. Would you see her work destroyed? You divide our nation and weaken our efforts against the Blight with your selfish ambitions to the throne. You're the one who divided Ferelden. I was not talking to you. I cannot forgive what you've done, Loghain. Perhaps the Maker can, but not I. Our people deserve a king of the Theron bloodline. Alistair will be the one to lead us to victory in this blight. The Emperor of Orlais also thought I could not bring him down. Expect no more mercy than I showed him. There is nothing I would not do for my homeland. <laughs> Three pompous asses. Well, that was bracing. Yeah. I didn't expect Loghain to show himself quite so soon. No kidding. Uh, what do we do now? Calling the landsmeet is only the start. Now we must ensure that every noble there sees Loghain's duplicity. We have no small task ahead of us. We need eyes and ears in the city. Loghain has been here for months. The roots of all his schemes must begin here. The sooner we find them, the better we can turn them to our advantage. Go have a look around, and see what you can turn up. Better yet, find the nobles who have arrived for the landsmate. Test the waters. See how many will support us. When you're ready to talk strategy, come upstairs to my sitting room. We can lay out our plans for the landsmeet then. All right, so that's what we will start doing in the next episode. Thank you guys for, uh, uh, for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Turn those post notifications on. Follow me on my social media 
All three are linked in the description, my Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. As well as if you want to support the channel monetarily, my Patreon is in the description as well. Have a great day, guys. Bye.